Bismillah Rahman Ibrahim. Dear viewers, today we will model pile cap with piles in EDAPS. Then we will see the analysis result for pile caps. So let's start. First, we will analyze the model and we will get the reaction dead dot plus live dot. Okay, here it is in kilonewton. 925 kilonewton. From here, we will find out how many piles are required in this column support. Then we will do pile arrangement. Okay. For example, diameter of pile pile is. Eighteen inch, eighteen inch. That means one point four hundred forty-five centi. Okay, forty-five centimeter. That means eighteen inch. Okay, eighteen inch pile diameter. Length of pile fourteen meter. Capacity of pile. 300 kilonewton. This will be calculated from soil report using skin friction and pile length, or um, using SPT value. Total reaction. It is coming here. 925. 9 to 5. Load with pile cap at 10% to 20%. I have added here 10%. Additional load. Then number of pile required 4. Settlement of pile head. This is coming from the pile diameter. Settlement of pile head 4.5 millimeter, 1% of pile diameter. Or if it is given in soil report, you can take that value. Vertical spring. It is coming from the pile capacity divided by the settlement. And horizontal spring 6.67 kilonewton millimeter. It is coming from 10% of vertical spring. Pile distance from S. It is coming 1 into diameter of pile. That means 45 centimeter. Range is 1 to 1.5 into diameter of pile. And pile is spacing 2.5 into diameter of pile. That means this one 45. Ends. That means three feet nine inches. Now we will make a pile arrangement for this one. Here we have some arrangement. I am showing how to do this arrangement. Okay. is as a block first of all we will take one pile this is having for example this is center of pile eighteen inch that means nine radius nine enter Fit six inch has been that means eighteen inch. Now this one will mess with this pile is facing just coming forty five inch forty five inter okay three feet nine inch then from here and take forty five now from here i will take pile cap like this and edge distance is here 18 inch so i will make offset o inter 18 inter like this okay now i make like this so this is coming we will make it block PC for number of pile so we can mark it as PC 4 okay like this 
now this one I can place it here and then mark it as PC4 in this way we will finish all the file arrangement with file cap for all other columns okay now we have finished our file arrangement with file cap now from this side as this is symmetric section or symmetric plan for both side we can mirror this one like this so we have finished our pile layout with pile cap now this pile cap and pile will model in details okay now for this one we will unlock the model then we will go to modify story data here our file length is 14 meter so we will add one story 14 meter number of added one from this none okay this one pc level pile cap and this one file level just p okay file bottom pp then click on ok now we can delete these supports now we can go to our this reference we will delete This reference plan we have taken to draw our stairs. Now we will go to this pile bottom. This is pile cap level here. First we will draw pile cap here, pile cap and pile here. Okay, this is PC4. So now we will take from here to here 3.3 3 feet 4.5 inch. That means uh, 3 3 into 12 36 and 4 40 40.5 means equal to. This is one zero one two point five millimeter. First, we can draw joint, draw joint object here. Here to here, one zero one two millimeter. We we'll check this is a millimeter x one zero one two point five offset from here also. This side also same one zero one two sorry one zero one two. 
click here like this here it is showing the column joints and this is our new joint so we can draw again 2025 minus here and cut this one paste like this like this okay now draw define slab this p p pc4 and go for slab 600 millimeter thickness for example okay now from here we will draw this one like this and from here 1 feet 10 22.5 draw joint object 22.5 562.5 millimeter Five sixty two point five sixty two point five like this minus minus here minus plus here and this plus minus like this so now here we will draw our circle we will draw our pile complete circle File 45 or 18 inch, okay. 450 done. You can okay, okay. And here, this is zero, this is zero offset. this okay we can hide our child now we can remove this support like this so this is our file with file cap Okay, we can see in section properties like this. This one object yes. We need to see this joint 
okay assign spring add new property this will be kv article okay then from here it is 66.67 66.67 translation z vertically okay you can done and add copy of property this k is horizontal this will be zero horizontal six point six seven six seven x and y direction okay done now here we will assign vertical apply okay and here we will divide this line frame object into 14 meter is 1 meter if we take segment then 14 segment 14 apply okay now we can rotate this one select all the node then assign okay is like this you can copy this one We'll see the joint replicate pick to point from here to here. Okay. Like this, here we will change our arrangement. We'll see this one. how much it will move before it was 22.5 now it will be 232 that means 9.5 inch it will increase in all side 9.5 Take this move upward nine point five. So this is nine point five inch, that means nine point five to thirty seven point five millimeters, zero point two thirty seven five meter select this and apply select this minus f1 and this side zero apply minus f1 okay now here in the middle there will be one pile like this this pile will break it out in segment then from from here only we'll assign spring kv apply okay and
error assign support none select all those lines okay then assign string k is like this at the last at the end of pile we will we have to assign particular spring assign like this okay so in this way we will model all other file cap and files so we have finished our file modeling with file cap now we will mirror this side files like this then show selected object go to 3d select all the object with nodes then go to plan again then duplicate mirror take two point from here to here apply close now show all object done now we can make joint invisible is it done now we can see our files in file cap you can see our file in file cap section proper okay now we will go for analysis and design plan now we will mesh the file caps select step floor this one assign this is for example 12 bins apply close Now we can run the analysis. After finishing analysis, we can see the result. our slab design or file camp design point load point in share now we will see the design result display punching check if it is less than one then it is passed if it is more than one that that file gap need to be modified with more thickness well, that means we have to increase the thickness for that file gap we can see in perspective view there is 
so for pile okay and for column also this pile cap is okay this one also okay i think all of this are okay we can see uh, for the pile location the punching ratio punching share demand capacity ratio is less than the column joint because in column joint the load is the total load is coming on column joint then we are resisting that column load by four piles so four piles is having less than this column joint load so if we if we get the column joint punching share demand capacity ratio less than one then we will decide that the pile cap is okay or fast to see the punching share result clearly file select okay now like this show selected object then invert visibility of object now we can see the demand capacity ratio for punching in column joints see so all the pile cap seems okay only this one here 1.65 1.36 that means this pile cap thickness needs to be increased so we can do that one this one we will see this is assigned as pc 76 we will define section property and opening this one pc 22 if i take it 30 inch okay then i'll assign this slab as pc 22 like this then run the analysis Okay, after the analysis, we can go for slab design. Now we can check punching share. So this reduced. So here 1.154. So maybe 2 inch or 3 inch increasing the depth for this pile cap we solve this issue now we can go for reinforcement design we can see display flex general design okay we can go for top paper field diagram we will go for finite element based you pose minimum reinforcement direction 1 top bar 1 means along x direction it is showing we will change our unit here we will go for unit form reverse area per length millimeter square per meter as see it is shine almost 900 1000 okay here for example for this pile cap at top layer 1142 1152 okay we will go for river design thickness is 
33 you see for example 33 into 25 that means 825 82.5 centimeter minimum required reinforcement this one uh, for this top here from the say for ETF stable at top it is required 1 250 or 1300 so governing still is minimum reinforcement 1485 if we provide 16 millimeter diaper it will come 135 millimeter spacing for top we can go for Direction on bottom bar. We are going for this one. So there we can see one seven one nine five nine. Here we can write this one bottom one nine five nine. That means six zero. So governing this one, if we provide sixteen millimeter diver spacing is coming 100 millimeter center to center or if we provide 18 milli it will come 125 so in this way we can design pile cap with piles in etabs or same way we can do it in safe also so thanks for watching stay tuned for more important tutorials Press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update.